will rock you at 100.1 WKQQ. Collective Soul, Led Zeppelin, the planet. New Van Halen next. We're getting ready for the show tomorrow night in Louisville. And now, if you can't make the, uh, the Van Halen show in Louisville, because it's sold out, there are still a couple of tickets left for Lonnie Love, who is joining me in the studio now. Yeah. You came back, didn't you? You know why? Because well, something about my milkshake. That's right. Your milkshake makes all the girls in the yard go poop. <laughs> 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 now you just now you just turn me on. <laughs> hey, uh, hey. Yeah, comedy off Broadway. Two shows tonight. Two shows tomorrow night. Lonnie yes. Love and Cindy Castillo came up. Met you. Made it back. Yes. Welcome. As promised. Thank you for le uh, letting us come back. And I see you still didn't uh, take off all these underwears, thongs. I mean, people. Be, I just want everybody out there to know. I come in here. He says he's all for me, right? He's got a whole. It's, it has to be a hundred. It's a slew, it's a slew, slew yeah. of thongs. It's a slew. Yeah. Of thongs all across the room. He didn't even take it down. Now, Thursday, I got to stay But Friday, it's Friday. Right. It's a whole new day. You could have took them down, Dave. Really? Well, at least could have done the, the laundry. Yeah. yeah. Brought them yes, back. yes. Whitney Houston's up there somewhere. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> uh oh. Hello. That crossed the line too soon? Oh, oh, oh. What? what? Now, oh, Whitney. now, Whitney's funeral is tomorrow, right? Yeah, they're streaming it live on the internet. Thank goodness for the internet. It'll be a private funeral. So, um, hey, you know, gone too soon. I tell people stay off of drugs. It's, no, it's not funny, people. Right. Especially, you know what kills me? They act like prescription drugs are not drugs. That's still mm -hmm. drugs. That's actually worse, because, you know, my crackhead family, they like, look, that's why we don't take all that stuff. We just stick with crack, because yeah. crack. You know, at least I know what I'm putting in my body. I'm like, really? Yeah, yeah. Ray Ray? Okay, I trust this dealer. I don't trust that man with a white suit. Ray, he can sell me anything. Uh, I've known Larry around the block for years. <laughs> we, we grew up together. You just like, you see that wrong me. And I can get a discount from Larry. Like, really? You know, I really don't need to know that. That loan is really. $37. <laughs> Whitney tried to go legit with a crack, and did you see all that? just didn't. It just didn't, you know, and it's just, it's sad right now. And then, of course, now all the mess is gonna about to start, you know, yeah. with the family and the sure. money. And, I heard heard Bobby Brown wasn't invited to the funeral. It, well, reports is that he put out a statement saying that that wasn't true. But, I mean, would you really want Bobby Brown at your funeral? <laughs> I mean, seriously? The whole funeral. <laughs> Holding around on this? Yeah, you know. As soon as the body's, you know, put down, everybody's going to look at Bobby like. <laughs> <laughs> You know, she never had made you. <laughs> right? <laughs> way to go. Like, Gateway to drug right. drug addiction. But you know, even in, I mean, I know this is a rock station, but we really do have some good music to remember her by. So I think oh. I always look at life as a celebration. You know, let's not, you know, what's done is done, but let's just celebrate. We have the memories and, you know, let's take care of ourselves. That's, you know, a good point. that's how I see it. Lonnie Love and Sidney Castillo, comedy off Broadway and uh, yes. 271 Joke for the tickets. 271. Five, six, five, Are you three. coming? Mm -hmm. All right. I'll be there. Uh, I mean, coming to the show, not coming. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> what? Just got real. Uh, nervous over there. I think she saw the look on my face. <laughs> <laughs> like, look, you see how he started stuttering. So. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> well, actually, both, Lonnie. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for asking. I'm uncomfortable. One later tonight for the second show, and one in about two minutes and two seconds. <laughs> Uh, it's WKQQ with comedy off Broadway and my first uncomfortable moment of the day. I like it though. Oh, I like it when a girl puts it in my face. So to, sp so to speak, Lonnie. You can take that any way you want. Uh, what about the Grammys? Did you watch the Grammys? Oh, yeah, the Grammys. Uh, first of all, I love Adele, but I was waiting for the Beach Boys to come up, okay? Yeah. You see, they, they are 3,000 years old and still stayed in pitch. I like that, okay? You see that? They hit them. They didn't need no auto tune and all that. And what was Ni Nicki Minaj? That? Nicki Minaj needs to I had to go to church after somewhere. I saw that. Yeah. I saw, <laughs> what did she do? Because I didn't see any. She, of like, did some exorcism, like, show where she was, like, dressed as a devil, touched a priest, he started convulsing, and then she had, I don't know. <laughs> She's trying to be the black lady Gaga. Yeah. I mean, it's really a desperate attempt. You know what? If you want to sell albums, sing. Do like what yeah. Adele does. You She's know, got she a sing. great voice, right? Oh, yeah, yeah she Nikki? does, but uh, I think... Nikki? No, I no. no. She's a rapper more she's than a, a singer. Okay, okay. You know, so she's just trying to do whatever she can to, Stay I guess, popular. sell some. Yeah, that's a shame. Yeah, you know, I heard, I heard God unfollowed her on Twitter. <laughs> Sorry. It's a multifaceted thing these days. You gotta, you gotta look the part. You gotta be able to, uh, you know, have some street credibility. Well, I mean, but they look at a, you look at Adele, who who swept the Grammys, 
And, you know, the first people, they want to get on her weight. Look, I am for the fat people. You come down to my show tonight, I'm going to show you all the fat people. You know, Lexi, they got some fat people. Oh, yeah. So, all y'all need to come and support your girl, because we're going to talk about these skinny people. Tired skinny people like you, Dave. I see you over there, just because you, you ain't got to show your arm. Okay, we know you're skinny. You know, it's like, it's, it's time for us to raise up. Right. You know, I am for my people from the barbecues in Mississippi to the buffets in Lexington. We're going to have a good time this weekend yeah. at Comedy Off Broadway. <laughs> Get the skinny people. All the fat people come. <laughs> Bring some snacks. <laughs> they don't have food at the club. Because it's a 45 minute show and I'm going to be hungry. <laughs> Somewhere right now, there's a fat person listening with a tear going out of the eye. <laughs> Like, you know what? I love Lana because she makes me feel okay to be me. Right. That's right. I'm coming to the show tonight. That's like, right. You I come and support me. me. Comedy <laughs> off Broadway with Lonnie Love and Sydney Castillo. We're coming back. Just don't you KQ. <laughs>